Okay, so this is a video about HID headlights and how they work. And I just woke up to it not too long ago, so I apologize if this video sucks. Yes, my dad has the same car, in case you guys didn't know. But I've gotten several comments and uh, quite a few private messages on YouTube ever since I put that HID video up. So I'm going to explain how they work and how to install them. Uh, I'm going to pop the hood. Go the window. So let me take this headlight out. I'll show you how they're bolted in and how you install them. Okay, so the only thing, like, the, how the hoods are installed are, it comes with a ballast, like a fluorescent light, that's that thing right there, and it also came with a bracket to mount it, and this piece of metal right here, I just got a, uh, two self-tapping, self-drilling sheet metal screws, they're like two inches long or something, it was what I had on hand, so I just drilled them through that huge, thick piece of metal, and they come out on that side. But it was easy, and they're out of the way, and they're not going to hurt anything like that. But, um, the way these heads work is you have the factory headlight harness, and that goes into the positive term, into the plug right here. Mine, personally, the uh, clip that's molded onto this stupid ballast is backwards, so yellow is positive, and you have the little plus right there, and then black is always negative, so th they molded this wrong this little clip right here but anyway um the original headlight like the original headlight would attach to this and you plug it into there and then the ballast has its own wire that comes out right here and then it goes to the head the HID headlight and it has its own clips right there and then the HID headlight just goes in like a normal bulb turn it back in and that's basically how they're installed it, it's really easy all you do is you friggin mount this and plug everything up okay so now as for daytime running lights daytime running lights at least on my car um, I know it's definitely not on every car but on a Buick Park Avenue and I think a Buick LeSabre um, all the daytime running lights are is uh, the high beams at half power. That way they shine yellow and really dim. So that way it's basically like the yellow of my mom's VX Century when it's driving down the road. But um anyway, the reason you can't use uh HIDs for your daytime running lights is HIDs do not work as uh half power. Like think of HIDs as a fluorescent light. Uh you can't use a dimmer switch on a fluorescent light. But you can use a dimmer switch on a halogen light. So, the problem is, if the HIDs don't have enough voltage, they'll just turn off. That's why whenever you flip on the switch, they just like pop on, there's no fade in or fade out. So, the problem is, with an HID in your bright light socket, it will always be like your brights are on. It won't be like you have any daytime running lights at all. It'll just be like you're driving down the road with your brights on. So, if you buy... Uh, an HID kit. Um, I know the GT, the Pontiac Grand Am or Grand Prix GTP or whatever. My friend does one of those. He's, he bought a HID kit for it, and the HID kit for the brights and the daytime running lights, they're still halogen. It, the actual HID kit came with a halogen filament for the brights, 
because of the daytime running lights, because HIDs do not run at half power. Um, and even if they did, they'd be just as bright, and they'd blind everyone coming down the road. So if I turn on my headlights, and then my brights, roll on my window. Like, that's what it would look like all the day long. Like, it would be like your hids were full power all day long. Be I mean, in theory, I guess d during the broad daylight it wouldn't bother people. But I think with hids it might get a little bit annoying. This is my brights on at full power. But uh, the daytime running lights, halogens can be run at half power. HIDs cannot because they go through a ballast and the ballast does not give power to the light unless it has full power so at a certain point of losing power they'll just cut off so uh, that is why you cannot use HIDs what I ended up doing was I just moved that little circle up there so anytime my car is on it thinks it's nighttime and my headlights are on all the time See, my car, oh, I still got my brights on. See, that's what my car looks like all day. I've got the hids on. So, that's basically it.